Yeah. <laughs> we found out that Isla had Pompe disease, which is a genetic disorder, a glycogen storage disorder, which affects the muscles in basically every muscle in your body. It was devastating to find out that she was also affected by Pompe. Um, but it was a it was a very, very scary and sad time for us. Um, until <laughs> we found out we had more options than what we expected. That the idea of in utero therapy was actually something we had talked about even you know a few years ago well when maybe we would have to treat Pompe in utero the, the the disease starts in utero the disease starts in the fetus you know there's evidence that the heart is involved even before the baby's born the innovation here wasn't the drug and it wasn't accessing the fetal circulation those are both things that were doable or done all the time the, the innovation here was treating earlier um, uh, and treating um, uh, while still in utero. Yeah, sorry about that. Really, uh, at this time, she's fine. Right? She's, uh, uh, she eats well, she's a mischievous little girl. Now what's, gonna, what's gonna be the case five years down the road? Right? What's gonna be the case 10 years down the road? Those are some of the unknowns. And I think that's where we do need more experience with other babies uh, uh, with Pompe disease. <laughs> without their help, like without... Without their help, you wouldn't hear all this noise behind you. <laughs> yeah, I had no gaps in the car, so I left early.